Have you ever wanted to buy a camera but were overwhelmed by all of the options out there? Today I'm going to discuss our camera buying guide so you can confidently begin the camera buying process. Every model of camera is slightly different. This is great when finding a camera that suits your needs, but it can be a bit overwhelming if you're not sure what you want. I'm Noel from Jotform, and here are the camera types you should be aware of as you look into buying your first camera. Compact cameras, also known as point-and-shoot cameras, are a great place to start. Their nickname, point-and-shoot, is fitting as they allow you to do just that, point, shoot, and end up with a pretty nice shot. They're small, lightweight, and a good option for people just getting into photography. They can also have more advanced zoom capabilities or manual exposure modes that take these simple cameras to the next level. Digital Single Lens Reflex Cameras, or DSLRs for short, are a bit more advanced of a camera. They're more expensive and heavier than compact cameras due to their advanced technology. DSLRs allow you to change your lenses so that you can use the right lens for the right context. There's also less shutter lag and more powerful autofocus with DSLRs. Although they can be expensive, some DSLRs can still be fairly reasonably priced. If you're diving into photography for the first time, this camera is another great option for you. If you're a photographer who wants to take their photos to the next level, literally, an action camera may be good for you. Good luck scaling Mount Everest with a bulky DSLR in tow. An action camera is great under extreme conditions. They're weatherproof, shockproof, and built to withstand pretty much anything. In terms of technological sophistication, action cameras are about the same as compact cameras since they need to be small enough to take on your big adventures. If you're into the DSLR option, but want something a little cheaper or more lightweight, look no further than a mirrorless camera. They boast many of the same features as a DSLR. However, they do lack an internal mirror, which is what ends up making these cameras a bit smaller than a DSLR. They still allow interchangeable lenses and large sensors. A mirrorless camera is a great option for a photographer who wants something fairly advanced without breaking the bank. If money is no issue, a medium format camera could be the camera for you. Medium format cameras boast amazing resolution. They're usually found in advertising firms, considering their price tags hover around the tens of thousands mark. So whether you're just stepping into the photography world or have many years of snapping photos under your belt, there's a type of camera just for you. Let's review. Compact cameras make it easy, just point and shoot. Plus your wallet will likely thank you. DSLRs cost a bit more, but allow you to change lenses. Action cameras are your adventure buddy, both weatherproof and shockproof. Mirrorless camera features are similar to a DSLR, but tend to be cheaper and more lightweight. And last, if money is no issue, the medium format camera has a tip-top quality resolution. And most importantly, strive to become a master of whichever camera type you choose by taking lots and lots of photos. Thanks for watching Jotform. I'm Noel. See you next time. <laughs>